Hi everyone, Aaron and Kim Burnett here in Winnipeg, Canada. And I'm going to do another song for you now that I've written about um, a wonderful little animal we have here in Canada called a raccoon. And a raccoon is um, oh, about the size of a, a mid-sized dog, if you haven't seen a picture of a raccoon before. But the interesting thing about raccoons is it looks like they wear a mask on their face because they've got these black colorings around their face. So I'm going to play the chorus once. Kim is going to be doing American Sign Language to it, and then we'll break it down a wee bit for you. So here's the way it goes. I'm Robbie Raccoon, I'm cute as can be. Two main things will help you recognize me. Have a bushy red tail, what else you may ask? But my mischievous face, I wear a little black mask. I'm a raccoon. I'm Robbie Raccoon. Kim, how, what are you doing there with a raccoon? A raccoon, a raccoon has, um, most, most that you see with a raccoon is its mask. mask so, it yeah, so you make a letter V with your hands, tilt it, tilt it towards, and then pull back over your face, and that's the mask. So it wears a mask on its face. Is that raccoon? That's, that's raccoon. raccoon. That's a word for a raccoon. Okay, yeah. raccoon. So, and then it's got a bushy green tail. So in order to do that, make uh, the letter L with your hand, and it doesn't matter which hand you use, make the letter L, tilt that, and point. Now point at your wrist, and wiggle your hand. Okay, so that's tail, but we're going to pet that. We're going to pretend that we're, we're petting it like it's a, a soft, soft and fluffy. fluffy cat tail. Okay, so it's got a bushy ring tail, it's got a mask on its face, and it's got tiny front paws. So make tiny little front paws with your hands, and it lives. So again, take the letter L with both hands, and reach down and pull up, and that's lives most every place. So you're putting your hand out and then rubbing in front of you, so it's like every place around you. And that's the chorus. They're found all over Canada, oftentimes by rivers and water, right? Let's do it. Tiny friend paws, tiny friend paws, and the 